We're going into right. the subway. It's lunch. And look at this is what they have that's new. Ooh, waffle what? fries. Yeah, that actually looks really good. All right, well, we gotta try it all. Oh, look at they're even making an omelet. So this is actually pretty interesting. Just like the sandwiches, they're all custom. So are the pastas. So you can actually pick which pasta you want, and then you pick protein and vegetables. And then here it says which sauce do you want. That's pretty cool. Hola, yo necesito uno chicken alfredo y meatball marinara. The smells right here are on. They're making love in the kitchen back there. They're loving the food. Oh my gosh. We got chicken Alfredo and we got the meatball marinara. Ooh. Expectation. Reality. Looking nice. Dude, the technique, spot on. You even see like that little wrist action there. So that was some skills right there. And all of this was made with Subway ingredients minus the Alfredo. I think that's the only thing different. Oh, and the pasta. So they got these bags ladled this thick, creamy Alfredo sauce all over. It looks freaking fantastic. This isn't a Subway, this is a diner. So this chicken is the same chicken that they have in the mainland. It's the same quality as the Olive Garden? Looks like it. Expectation. Reality, I love Subway and Evolve. This actually just makes sense for Subway to do a pasta. I've never been at a Subway with a pasta before, but right now, I do not feel like I'm at Subway. Did you say Olive Garden? This is awesome. It's actually ringing bells, not taco bells. Holy, you should put this on the menu. No graveyard, you're very much alive. I kind of like it, but I like the Alfredo better. I like the Alfredo better. Yeah. When it comes to a tomato sauce, I mean, it's got to feel like, you know, it's made from something scratchy. No. I don't get that vibe from this. If you like the meatball sub at Subway, you're going to freaking, like, be all over this. Like, up and down and inside. Alfredo, definitely better than that. Pasta at Subway. I'm wowed. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Alfredo, yay. Yes? Maybe no. Put it on the list. I'm going to keep this at the bottom of the list. Nope. You're not dead to me. I still like you. It's not healthy, though. How are you peeing? Sandwiches. How lucky are we right now? What could this possibly be. Let's find out. Is double wrap, double concealed? This is triple wrap. This is triple the tripletta? Wrap. Yeah. Oh, that is. Because I like the meat. Expectation over there? Reality. What do we think? It's looking kind of bomb. I mean, let's just admire the steps in creating that. Cook down all the vegetables, they throw in the meat, then they throw it on the sub. There's layers of effort that go into this. And it is smoking. This is a loaded sandwich. So you can see in there they got ham, bacon, roast beef, and cheese to combine it. And then it's served on a bun with lettuce and mayonnaise. We went Italian. But you can choose any Subway roll. Mm. I love this. Well, this is really, really freaking good. Like mm -hmm. a chopped cheese. Chopped cheese is delicious. It's like when you eat Chinese food and you're still hungry afterwards. Does this have MSG? Staying on the list. Tripletta at Subway. This is also going to stay on the list. I haven't even had it yet. Open it. These subs get a little greasy because they come out of the saute pan. Here's the expectation and reality here. Yeah, it doesn't look that good. Look at that picture though, my goodness. We got to watch them make this. They actually just scooped the chimichurri right into the saute pan. Really look good in the ad, but... It doesn't matter what it looks like. It matters what it tastes like. It looks like we got the roast beef with the chimichurri mixed in. Green peppers, lettuce, tomato. This is a six inch. Boop, 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 boop. Subway. Oh my God. Jam packed with meat. I like the chimichurri. It's that oily, herbal, spicy flavor. It proves any steak. Trying to be a pesto. A little bit kinkier. Right. You like this better than the tripletta? I think I like the tripletta more. Me too. Those three ingredients together make this kind of addicting, I need more thing. This is so like savory that I feel like I'm eating like a dinner for lunch. Having the peppers in there as a crunch that I'm not used to in a sandwich like this, but I do think it tastes good. It's not going in the graveyard. Definitely cannot go in the graveyard. We're getting picky and fancy at this yeah. point. That's how good these things are. Let's make a tripletta as a hack. Yeah, we should. For some reason, Subway wanted to jump on the Chick-fil-A bandwagon. <laughs> we got waffle fries. Whoa. These look like when you bought Chick-fil-A waffle fries, brought them home, kept them in your fridge for a week, and then you air fried them. That's what these are. It's kind of unfortunate. I think they're aware of this. Subway, why did you do this? <laughs> like, what were you thinking? The hash browns were slightly better than this, but still really bad. Dunkin' Donuts is better. But that's not all. Yeah, we're gonna finish this, our experience with something that Subway should also not have on their menu. They have here. But maybe it's better than we think. It does use their ingredients, minus whatever the dough is. The Lucas. They just make the bread. The rest is Subway. And? And? Pizza. Does it look like the picture? Quadrental pepperoni. I actually saw him cutting the big pepperoni pieces into the little quadrants and now here they are on the pie. If they got good cheese and they got good sauce, then this should be good. There's the expectation. Here's reality. Ooh, a little bit of cheese pull. 
Who do you think the audience is for this? A child? Or adults that are still children inside. Pizza Hut is better than this, but this might be healthier than Pizza Hut because it's not like super oily. Actually, I don't mind this pizza. Is this the same marinara that they do for the meatball? We saw the dough. It's obviously a pre-made dough that they just have ready to go so they can just put the toppings on just like a piece of bread for a sub and they stick in the oven to melt. It's a quick, easy pie. Six, seven dollars for a pie? It's not bad. Are you gonna order this at Subway? I'd probably go for a sub. What do you think? I like it. It's like innocent. It's like a fresh version of a Chuck E. Cheese. It's served almost pita bread. See how it's like kind of opening up here? I literally got my hand in there. I've had way worse pizza. Yeah, when you're eating pizza at a place that's not supposed to have pizza, normally it's gonna be huge red flag scenario. This is better than most Florida pizza. I mean, this is like a kid meal pizza. You really can make this pizza any way you like with all the toppings at Subway, so you're not stuck with a pepperoni pie. Kind of fun. You're bored of the same sub at Subway because you always go to Subway. They're changing the game. So what's your favorite thing that you tried at Subway? This pizza. No way. I'm surprised how much I like this Alfredo. Alfredo and a Tripolata. Go get it now. Are we really on the same page with this one? Yeah. What about the breakfast items? You're not gonna nestle any of those into it? There have had breakfast at one spot in Puerto Rico. It's all the same. Burger King, Wendy's, McDonald's, and Subway. And I gotta tell you, at the breakfast, if you get it anywhere, it's very similar. And you'll enjoy it. The thing is, with this saute pan situation over here, the hot sandwiches for lunch are the things that you really gotta go out and get. Them. I love it. These sandwiches in the pastas are where it's at. Let's do a round of applause. Very impressed. Rico. Eat freaking fresh. They made it right in front of us. They really making everything. So nice. And they have a drive through Let's be real, like these are the real stars. They're like sandwich baristas. They must have a cheat sheet in the back for every sandwich that's like 20 steps long, because I swear, watching them make that gave me anxiety, especially if there would be a long line behind us. You gotta be on your toes. That's true. Hey Subway, we're eating fresh, but you're so fresh, fresh to death. Chicken, chicken, what? Okay, I'm gonna eat a little more. I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. So now that we ate Subway, do you wanna eat some more Subway? 